warn you, some of the pictures and video you're about to see very hard to look at. Precious was found in Delaware County weighing less than half of what she should. Fox 29, Seanette Wilson live in media tonight where volunteers are trying to save her life. Seanette. Yeah, Thomas, those uh, volunteers don't get it, and neither do I. You have an animal, you don't want it, you can give it to somebody who does, and they'll take care of it. This dog's name is Precious, but investigators say the owners didn't treat her that way. Instead, they starved her and left her to die. She brought me to tears. Take a look into these deep, dark brown eyes of three-year-old pit bull terrier mix Precious. They're beautiful, but they hold a lot of painful memories. The basement was just infested with fleas, as was Precious, and feces everywhere. She had near fatally um, anemia. Her blood levels were so low, she could hardly keep herself alive. But thanks to an alert repairman fixing a water heater at a home in Chester, Precious now has a chance to live again. They saw the skeleton and thankfully the beating heart. It's painfully obvious no one fed her. Just look at her bones bulging through her skin. And she just really was down and out. Rescue workers brought her here to the Delaware County SPCA a week ago. She's eating now and starting to drink on her own. Piles of blankets help stabilize her body temperature. Precious came in weighing just 19 pounds, less than half of what she should weigh. Medicine is a major part of her care, but certainly not all of it. A lot of it is TLC because, you know, we really just want her to know that she's loved now, you know, like she wasn't before. Now back here live, Precious will not be up for adoption anytime soon. She's not even walking on her own yet. In the meantime, the Delaware County SPCA says what they really need right now is donations. Uh, they need money to help continue to care for Precious, blankets, that sort of thing. If you want to help, go to MyFoxPhilly.com. We put a link to their website there to tell you how you can help out. Uh, in the meantime, again, they're continuing to try to nurse her back to health. Reporting live in Media, Delaware County, I'm Seanette Wilson, Fox 29 News.